princess be a bad Hey guys, so we are going to start this video off with a Shein haul and thank you to them for sponsoring your girl. Alright, because I'm starting my video so please quiet on set. Quiet on set. Hey guys, I am back with another Shein haul. You guys say y'all was here for more hauls and I got y'all. Y'all yeah, know the pieces are going to give every time. So I have a package here with me that I'm going to open up and, you know, try on the pieces with you guys. So this is more so of like a spring, summer, I guess you would say, haul. As you guys see. We got some pieces in here that we're gonna get into. So we got pieces from crop tops, shorts, we got some jeans. We just got a whole bunch of flavors in here. Y'all know their website is full of many cute pieces. So make sure you guys check them out. And when you do shop with them, y'all know I got y'all with a discount code, which is bad tammy to save some coins so make sure you guys use that discount code and with that being said we're gonna go ahead and get into trying on these pieces let me start off with accessories so we're starting off with sunglasses which those are my only accessories but it's these red tinted sunglasses and i really just love like the shape of it i feel like it fits my face very well so a close-up this is what they look like and like I mentioned, they have like a red tint. So when you put them on, you actually see like everything in red. So I really just like like the oversized style of these. So cute. Next up is some other shades. And they usually come in this like black leather case. And they come with like the little dusty. So these are some pink ones. And they have like a little bubbly look to it. And they're more so like round shaped. I believe these are like a dupe to, I don't really know the name of it. But let's try them on. I really love like the bubbly look of it. So cute. Next up, I actually have these clear frame glasses. Y'all know I love to cop me some of these to cover the bags when I'm going through it. So this is what they look like. I really love for my frames to have like a oversized look to them. And I really love like the squared look. I feel like it gives me like a little nerdy kind of teacher look y'all definitely gonna be seeing me rock these soon because y'all know a girl be tired you i believe they had these in a clear version and also pink if i'm not mistaken but i just wanted to keep it simple and go with black just so it could you know match with everything and give more so of like a real like prescription glasses all right so now we're gonna get into the actual clothing items all right so the first pieces is this cropped ribbed tank top and it's in like this nude color i really love this um what really caught my attention was this like small detail in the middle it's like this silver tag with like a h i believe with like bedazzled it's like very simple but cute and i actually paired it up with these jeans that are like very ripped up and I don't know if you can tell, but it has like that same nude wash to it as well. I believe this is considered like a vintage wash. Let me put you guys down. These jeans I'm like obsessed with guys. They're very distressed, like literally all down the legs, all in the back, the pockets, everywhere. Very distressed. I really love the wash to it, like I mentioned. And this together with this top actually goes perfect and they fit me very very nice i really love the fit to it i believe these are a size 27. the bottoms are actually a little like wide legged 10 out of 10. all right so next outfit is this all white on oh my godly yo gotti ish let's start off with the pants as you guys see there are some cargos and they have these oversized pockets on the sides which you guys know pretty much the cargo look they also have these pockets in the back 
um these are in a size 27 as well and they seem to have like a little runched effect on the knee area they do have drawstrings right here to adjust but i feel like these give me more so like a fitted look than more so like um baggy and then we're gonna get into the top as you guys see it fits very nice it does say some words on there which it says i'm not shy i just don't like you and if you know you know i kind of feel like that's me you know like when you get around new people they'll be like why are you shy why are you so quiet you just like girl i don't really know you like that so i just really love the slogan and then actually with this outfit i could actually you know add the red sunglasses and just give it that color pop so this is what this will look like together so cute which is what i love about like all white looks and like all black looks i feel like you can always add accessories to make it pop and just come all together so yeah i really love how this outfit looks together with like some red sneaks this would be fire next up as you guys see we have this very cute like two-in-one tank top and i'm just so obsessed with it i feel like it's just so different which i know she in is known for different pieces on their site so it's pretty much this like white runched up top and it has like this bra under it this pink fluffy bra that you actually put on your neck like a little halter top it comes together like i said it's like a two-in-one and when i seen it on the model i feel like it just brought me like old Nicki minaj vibes if you know you know and it was pink and it just gave it to me it just gave me like really girly like barbie vibes i feel like it would look cute with some white bottoms maybe not cargos but maybe like some white shorts like an all white look and then you know add, add the accessories for the pink so next top it's this like graphic tank top i really love like the cut style of this kind of giving me like a little turtleneck vibe but not really so as you guys see it's pretty much like a face you can see like eyes we got like some lips right here and that's pretty much the same detail of the whole shirt and like i mentioned for all white looks or like all black looks you can always add a color to make it pop which is actually what i did and i just paired this with some black bottoms okay so these are the parachute pants that i paired it with i actually grabbed these pair in a pink and i loved the fit of them so i got them in black just to you know keep it more on the neutral side i love the fitting of these i do get my pants in a medium just so they can have like that comfy baggy oversized look as you guys see and they have like these oversized pocket on the sides and they actually have like these drawstrings on both sides just hanging and they actually have these drawstrings at the bottom as well for you to you know scrunched up if you want more so of like a cuffed look at the bottom but i pretty much love like the wide leg look then it has like these side pockets and back pockets well just one back pocket right here and it's in like this very like i think is a nylon material i don't know if i'm saying it right like i said you can make it pretty much pop with colors and you know red shoes red bag keep it going it can also pretty much look cute with the pink shades so just a few options for you guys to see that you can pretty much make any color pop with this this is really cute yeah can't tell that girl nothing this is really cute i don't know why it seems like i have so much black and it's home we're supposed to have like vibrant colors going on but anyways next top has like this rhinestone detail and it says lucky and as you guys see baby them rhinestones is glitzing on the website seemed like it was very much red but it, i feel like it's giving me like red and like bluish purple so which is why i paired it with these black cargo pants that as you guys see they have like this red detailing in the front like the drawstring is like red and it also has the drawstrings down here at the bottom that have red detailing so i just felt like pairing it together would just make perfect sense i don't know do you guys see like the red vibes that i see in the shirt 
but these cargos fit like a glove y'all as you guys see they have like that drawstring so it kind of is giving me like a v shape in the front but not too much definitely hugging the body this is what they look like from behind i don't know if you can really see since it is black but it has like that runched um illusion that i've been seeing a lot on bottoms it gives like that big booty illusion and like i mentioned it has like the drawstrings in the bottom so you can actually give a little more of a runched effect on the sides that pretty much matches the same as the back so the next item is these jeans and these are very much different and cute do you guys see that detail they have like this star patch on them and it has like this raw distress like all on the outline of it so it has one on this side and then it also has one down here on the knee area and they actually have a little bit distressed up here at the top and also at the bottom it pretty much has like a green wash to it going on. I don't know if you guys can really like see. Let me bring the camera down. This is a closer look of them. So cute. I really love like the star detail to it. And I was actually supposed to do a look with these on my mom's birthday week. Since y'all know her nickname is like Star. And I had got these nails which they're like kind of messed up now. Like with some star details on there. I just felt like it would have been like just so cute like the details all tying in together but i haven't got to style them yet and i cannot wait to actually wear them okay so these are the next bottoms there are these green cargos but i feel like these cargos are more so on the like sexy side which i know i'm all here for it's like this deep deep v shape cut in the front and it has like this runched up band to give it more of a like fitted look they do have big pockets it's three pockets on each side and i really just love this front detail this color is very cute it's like a army green i would say they fit me a little more on the like hot water that's actually all the bottoms that i'm gonna try on for you guys i did have two other pair of jeans sadly they did not fit me so now we're gonna get into two pieces because i do have a few first two piece that's not actually a two piece and doesn't even fit me is this brown fuzzy set so on the website they look the same and as you guys see they have that same fur detailing going on but in person i don't know if you can like really see because it looked like it's picking up the same on the camera the top is actually much darker than the skirt the top has more of like a knitted look going on as into the skirt has more of a ribbed detailing so yeah and as you guys see the skirt does not fit me i guess i needed to size up to a large because this is a medium so just a close-up view as you guys see it has this fur trim the top is actually like a halter you put it around your neck and tie it and it does have this drawstring crisscross kind of thing going on in the middle and then this is the skirt that i can't even breathe in but it was pretty much the back for me for the skirt that made me just want the whole set it has like heart fur detailing on like the pockets y'all can't tell me this ain't cute with like some fur boots this will be a freaking look but sadly it doesn't fit and i did want to mention that a lot of the pieces that i seem to pick up on seem to have this pink sheen icon tag on it so i'm guessing it's under like a collab that they might have did and most of the pieces like this on that section are the cute girly pieces that give more so of like that old school vibe that watu um k vibe that i was telling you guys about so if that's kind of like more so your style make sure to check out the um icon section all right so my next set is this comfy two-piece set which you guys know is pretty much perfect for this weather a comfy two-piece outfit that you just put on and go but i feel like this one kind of gives me a little more like homey vibes as you guys see they're like these shorts and tank top and they do have like a ribbed design going on the shorts do have drawstrings that are like adjustable i really love this pretty pink color on my skin and i just love the overall fit of it as you guys see it fits the body very nice i'm here for a comfy two-piece and then this set actually came with this tag it says she in actually has like a lot of different sections for you guys to shop from which you know different vibes going on this one says she in e easy wear and it just says easy wear easy life so i'm guessing this will be more so of like the cute comfy two pieces 
in this section so make sure to check them out next two piece is this cute like little dupe but i feel like this one is a little bit more breathable and more like stretchy i did get this set in a small that's maybe the reason if i would have got an extra small i don't think it would have been as like you know comfy and breathable as it is so i'm glad i didn't size down so the top is like this tank top and it does have like like this stitching of like a a slight darker gray going all along and the shorts have like this boxer kind of look to it and it has like that same little stitching detail going around it and i really just love like this heather gray color and just how comfy this outfit feels and looks this is what the outfit looks like from the back just very comfy i'm not exaggerating guys it's just comfy breathable and very stretchy i definitely give this set a 10 out of 10 and hopefully they have other colors because i do want to cop me another outfit or two so next up we have like a more so of like a homebody two-piece and also like a more of a sleepwear lingerie kind of two-piece as you guys see it's like these very short shorts this like cami top i really love the material of this as you guys see it has like this knitted detail going on it also has like this small bow at the top right here and also on the waist waistband right here and it's in this pretty nude color the material to this though i really love it it's like i can't really describe it but i'm definitely going to be able to sleep good and just you know walk around the house still you know being cute or whatnot y'all know i love to grab me some cute sleepwear it just gives the night routine like a vibe and when i say i always always have to grab me cute sleepwear from them i mean it so this one is just like this pretty hot pink and if you guys haven't noticed their silky satin collection for sleepwear is my fave like if you haven't copped you one definitely cop and just the silkiness of this just does it definitely gives the nighttime routine like i said just like a different vibe what's the better way to go into sleep feeling all cute this one is actually a little different as you guys see the shorts have like this ruffled kind of thing going on at the bottom I really love it i feel like it makes it look like a little more like girly and sexy and don't sleep on their sleepwear like just don't sleep on it literally grab you a pair so next up we have this bathing suit i don't know if it's tmi on here it's this three-piece bathing suit set and baby when i say this is cute go add it to your cart right now i don't know if you guys see like this texture that it has it's like very fluffy i really love it i feel like it adds a pop to it this is the top that you have to tie at your neck and then you also tie back here and as you guys see it does come with a skirt like cover up and i really just love how this pink looks on my skin even though y'all do know it's my favorite color but this is pretty so lastly we cannot end this without having a dress surprisingly i thought i ordered more dresses and now that i do think about it i know i ordered this dress in two other colors but i am glad i did get to get at least one this is beautiful i'm trying to back up so you guys can see it because baby the body is there the body is there it's like this very light like lavender purple i don't know how i don't have more than one dress in this haul because baby are you really in the springtime if you don't have your dresses or your sundresses like look at this y'all well, beautiful so with that being said guys this is actually my last item i hope you guys enjoyed this mini haul don't forget to use my discount code bad tammy with shopping with she in and make sure to check my description box down below bye hey guys welcome to my channel it's your girl bad tammy and i am back with another weekly vlog and as you guys see your girl is rocking some little color rape braids how was you guys feeling now i just got them done yesterday and i just took the curls out today so yep this is what the hair is given and i'm actually dressed up because i'm about to head out we are about to start this vlog getting straight into some things um today is actually tuesday so i am hosting like a taco tuesday for the family and it's actually like a little pre Cinco de Mayo turn up or whatever so that's the end goal for today so I have a lot of store runs to do and a lot of things to grab I was actually supposed to go yesterday but 
I didn't. So hopefully that doesn't really push me behind too much. I have to go to the Mexican store. I have to go to Trader Joe's and I also have to go to Marshall's. And I pretty much already have my list and hopefully I don't forget anything because your girl is good for forgetting things. So with that being said, your girl is pretty much about to go ahead and head out because I'm dressed and I already got this on the dress. I do just need to put my little sweater on because the weather has been acting up over here. I don't know if you guys can really hear it. And my voice but my nose is like a little stuffy it just started yesterday so that's really why i didn't feel like getting up but i'm just wearing this all pink skims outfit of course is the bralette the sweater and then i have some sweats let me show it to you guys so this is what your girl giving and i just paired it with these so yeah guys i'm about to get ready to head out and of course you guys will be coming along with me so Let's go. I couldn't even do a cute little video pulling up at Marshall's because they took the sign off. These black parts are giving. It's like giving sleek, clean, like the aesthetics. I think I'm gonna grab me one. So these are actually not compatible with my stove top. And I did find these little taco stands. I believe I have some, but I'm gonna just take a few just in case. I honestly came in here to look for some serving trays like this, but a log one that I found in here. But they actually don't have none. As you guys see, they have like a lot of these bamboo vibes going on, but they don't have the one that I'm looking for. So we're actually about to get ready to head out. Yeah. Now I'm just gonna be picking up stuff that I don't need. All right, so now we're at Trader Joe's with it. So we are home now for running all these errands and we is about to get some food in our stomach. I got shrimp right and rice and beans. And Tazana's eating the same thing over here. Mm. It's good. So I'm about to just eat this. And then I think I'm gonna go ahead and get started. Because my mom is actually supposed to come and make some homemade tortillas for us. I wanna give the pink tortillas a try again. But y'all know this time my mom is gonna make them. I'm not gonna be doing them like on that machine, I don't know if you guys remember that one time I tried to make them and it was a fail. So I'm really excited for that. So all that's on the menu for tonight. Because I'm being extra. Oh, this one is good. This is the classic cola from Poppy. It tastes literally like a healthy um, Coke. But anyways, the menu is al pastor mi um, carne asada. I'm going to have some fish tacos. Because my friend that doesn't eat meat is going to come. And I'm gonna try to make the birria tacos. I wanna make some guac. So I got chips for guac and chips. We're gonna have corn. Well, actually the corn is already done because I made some yesterday. We grilled some and I had a lot left. So I'm gonna just use that corn. I'm supposed to be making some spicy mango um, margaritas for us. And then what else? Yeah, and that's all. So I'm excited for later. So I definitely need to start prepping. So I'm gonna just finish my food for a little bit and then come back. Alright y'all, so I'm gonna quickly show you guys a little bit of the things that I got. I found this like tortilla warmer 
and I just really liked it because it had like all those peppers and chilies and stuff in there. Then I got this little turnable, maybe to put like the stuff for the corn, like you know, so it can be on there. Spinny. I'll show you guys the little taco stand. I found the um, pink da. Then from Party City, I would have thought that would have had like a lot of like Cinco de Mayo stuff, like mexican-ish but actually they didn't i got to find the sombrero because i actually want to put like the chips on here for the guac um similar to how we had did it for my mom's birthday that one year found this taco hat but i might just let you know put it up for decor i found these colorful margarita cups and they like disposable so i thought these were just so cute because they had four different colors i got to find this taco tuesday sign and then this tablecloth and from the Hispanic store, you guys pretty much see my list. I just need onions, tomatoes, the meat. Hopefully, I got enough. Because it looks like a little bit, but I'm not sure. This is the masa for the tortillas. And I got regular tortillas. And then I just got like the jalapeno for the margaritas. Then serranos. Then we got limes. Cilantro. Mangoes. Because I want to use these for like garnish. And then from Trader Joe's, you guys see me get these chips. I got some of the chicken soup dumplings. I actually tried these for the first time last week, and y'all, 10 out of 10. We're probably going to be eating these soon anyway. And I told you guys I want to try their um, birria taco, so this is what they look like. I went to Trader Joe's last week, and I grabbed up on this spicy mango lemonade. I have yet to try it. I literally have one in my fridge. But as I was thinking, I really grabbed it because I was like, this will be good with a drink. Like, just add tequila and it will be good. This is pretty much the mix that I'm going to be using to make the margaritas. So, we're going to see. Let me actually, I'm going to try it. Yes. Oh, and it's spicy. It is spicy. I never really had like a spicy drink, but this is like good. Yeah, that is gonna hit. So from Trader Joe's, y'all, definitely try it. And then I got four of these in total. Then I got some avocados. And then I also got the tilapia fish. My bros are dead. I should've got some new ones from But I'm gonna start off by putting this right here on this table. Hopefully it doesn't matter because the table is round. So this is what it looked like and then pretty much this is where the chips and um, guac will go since it's like a you know appetizer. I'm gonna actually go ahead and start off by cooking this meat and um, cutting up like the onions. I'm gonna use my slicer and then like the limes, cut the cilantro and I never actually made guac but I did look up some recipes so I'm gonna try to wing it if not i'll probably wait on my mom to get here to see if she made some before i'm gonna go ahead and cook this one up all right y'all mama australia has pulled up to help me <laughs> So she's actually doing the meat because I was just doing like one by one but she trying to do everything all together she actually told me she know how to do walk so I'm just following her instructions I'm about to cut up two uh, maybe three avocados I already cut up the tomatoes serranos and extra onions in here and then she's actually gonna get started on this in a minute all right y'all so my mom already made this but I can't really show y'all because I was over there cutting cilantro. And I'm going to add a little bit of the food dye, the pink one. Ma, mm. verdad? She told me she ain't never heard of no pink tortillas. <laughs> so, 
So I'm going to show it to y'all. But y'all pretty much see it's getting pink. So we got this little soft pink color. We're going to see if it still pink when she put them on the comal. Well, I don't have a comal. So we're going to use this little flat top. And hopefully it works. Yeah, you got that yummy, yummy. The tortillas are coming out. Look at that. These are the real tortillas. Because when I was trying to do it, <laughs> it was not given. Alright, and then mix this up. I'm geeked that the tortillas is coming out. Le chate fe. Oh, it's a little bit. Aquí en esta boca vamos a poner la tortilla. You really supposed to have like a little basket with the mantel, ¿verdad? O como se dice la de eso. Tortillero. Así. Pruébalo tú, ponle y meneale y ahí le. She keep trying to let me figure it out, mom. ¿Cómo se va a enseñar entonces a la cosa si no? I might have tried this. I'm a little too deep. No pica. No me la pongo un poquito más. Quería como unos cuatro aguacates para que saliera mucho. Y'all can see my mama on there with the tortilla. Todo van a quedar guacamole porque nunca se ha hecho guacamole. Así que. She told me it's a little bit. I asked her how many I should do. She told me just do um two and I added three. It's busting though. I'm about to start making some. Yeah, I see. Y'all gonna watch my mama do tortillas for a little bit. since earlier but she had an eye exam so i'm about to put the corn on this um big turnable i'm actually gonna put the corn in here just because it's not really that many like i thought so this is the corn and the condiments for that is gonna go on here like i mentioned now this is the log that i was going to look for at marshall's earlier so i think i'm gonna put the other meat on this one so it can be both like on the round ones but that's what I'm about to do now. Put the meat on in here. All right, y'all. Quick update. Nana actually ended up fixing the corn so we could just, you know, have the dis display like this. And it looks so much better. And then we also already have this all out. The tortillas are still in the bag so they can be warm. And then Nana actually put the margarita cups out here. And then this is the chip display like I told you guys. And then we got the guac right here. All right, so now we're going to make the drink. Are you gonna already go have these top? poured up, or you're just gonna? Nah, I think I'ma. Yeah, I think I'ma just do the rim on these. I'm gonna put the lemonade in here with the Tito's, and then I'ma just put the rim 
on here. And then everybody can just serve themselves. Pour all the lemonade in here? Yeah. It's spicy. Bro, this tastes like you got straight that Like, like mangonada. Don't it taste like a mangonada? Oh, maybe you should have got more. And how much tea is you going to put in here? Mm -hmm. So you don't really got a specific measurement? No. Then I have this um, mango flavor rim dip. And then the tahini. I think I just want to put it on like one side. What you think? What's that? Um, like this? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to just do like one little side. Because I actually wanted to do the garnish mango. So we will put the mango on this side. Taste Taco Tuesday, I got the cheese, she tasting the Kool-Aid. She go the blood with a hoop bag. She gon' do with the cooks with the brick day. Caliente. She get the bad, but she gotta get it ten ways. Okay, now kinda like, kinda like. I don't want this money, make. Money, make it elevate. Tell her, she ain't day, like she on the runway. The payday, when she get the comfort. I'ma see the one to kill her in the bomb bag. Seen in the corner, sack of one way. Smoke, murder, bust, take her off a skirt. Put him, put him, put your name on a skirt, skirt, skirt. He drive me to the fucking like the fur, fur, fur. He can't put your face on a shirt, shirt. Man, I've never given way since fur, fur. My name Jose. It's a long line at the doorway. Serving taco, get him with the nacho. Fucking with a bad vibe, but she go both ways. Then up the record, the show day. I never ever see a pro day. All right, y'all, we about to get the vibes going. We about to get some guac. Nana, have you tried the guac? It's given. <laughs> I'm about to start making my food. I didn't get to show y'all um, the fish that I made, but that's what it's given. And I made some um, spicy sriracha sauce. Heavy on it. It's the gang for me. <laughs> So I'm actually frying the tortillas a bit like we usually do the other ones and then letting some of that oil soak up But y'all I forgot to get plates I forgot plates. I'm gonna put it on my pink plate and I grab the taco stand I'm about to make my tacos. The only thing is that I gotta warm up the meat again I already added the meat. Now I'm about to add these onions well, I'm gonna just show it to you in a minute Cause we trying to get the vibes going Y'all know how to dress tacos up. Alright, y'all. This is my plate. A little zoom in. I'm already done eating, so I'm about to sip on my drinky drink. It hit with the little ramp too. But they actually didn't end up garnishing with the mango. Say hey to the taco camp. Hey taco camp. They already ate. Karen, where your plate? Right here. Show them your taco. Tell them how you didn't want to eat pink tortillas. I didn't want no pink tortillas. I don't know why. And no salsa. This Nana plate. I already ate three more. Ten out of ten. Jay, your plate. You like the pink tortillas? What Normal you, tortillas just with color. <laughs> what you rate it? A 9 out of 10. It's hitting. And Jarrito, where'd that come from? Oh, do I ate about 30 corns? Yeah. Where your tacos? I already oh, you already them. ate them. Mama Estrella been on making taco duties. Mm. And she mad. Mm. 
No, actually, she was supposed to be making her own tacos, and then Karen wanted to make her tacos, and she didn't move, so she wanted to do that. Charlie, where your plate? I already ate. Oh, you already ate. Where your plate, Charlie? Cheers. Taco cheers. <laughs> All right, y'all, Claudia has joined the taco night. This is her plate with avocados and her drink. Rate the drink. From eight to 10, it's a little spicy. You already it's spicy, spicy. Like it for a drink. It's given and drink. That's spicy, right? Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Ezekiel, Yeah. Okay. Why is it Hey guys, so it's much later in the night. It's like 3 30 and as you guys can tell your girl is smizzed just a little bit but I'm about to hydrate and drink some water so I can be good in the morning but I just wanted to update you guys that this is the end of our little taco Tuesday situation and it was a vibe so good night guys hey guys so today it is Thursday and I actually have a nail appointment today but I actually want to run a errand or two before I head towards that way recently actually my nail tech moved into a new apartment and I believe she finished with esthetician school. So I want to get her a little something, you know, as a congrats for that. So basically like a housewarming and congrats gift, whichever we get to find since it is like so last minute. And as far as outfit goes, um, the same um, skim sweater, but I paired it with some blue jeans that got like some ribs and I'm wearing it with the pink Rickies. Even though it's not the same pink, but it's kind of the same to my bag. So, I'm going to wear this bag mm -hmm. like so. So, basically, this is what it's given. Cute or whatnot. Excuse that over there. I'm supposed to be making a little gift bag. Gift basket that I haven't got to. Oh, and then peep this cute pimple patch that I actually stole from Nana. So cute, right? But before I head, I actually want to show y'all this that shayla gave me on tuesday she got me this forero chocolate box then she also gave me this um card so it says thank you and it says thank you for always helping me it's really appreciated and not unnoticed she said love you ho shayla and then she put this gift card in here you first get starbucks Aww, that's so nice i'm actually about to go ahead and put this in my bag i was gonna get starbucks in case we use it Yep, for Starbucks. That that was really sweet. Yeah, that was really um. That was very sweet. Yeah, that was very sweet. I did not expect that. I believe she gave Nana one as well because when she gave it to me, I was like, "What is this for?" And she was like, "It's just um a little thank you for you know I was helping me with my YouTube stuff." So that's what that is because I actually am reviewing one of her videos right now. That's what I um spent all day doing yesterday. So make sure you guys go subscribe to my sister's channel. You know, show love to all the bad sisters. But anyways, y'all, we about to head out. I'm going to see where we go. I am thinking like Target maybe and see whatever homey vibes I get to find. But at the top of my head, I am thinking I want to get her maybe like snacks because she does have like a snack bar and she started off strong like she will always have it stocked up every time i ask her, i'm like you got water she never be having water and stuff so i think it would be nice of me you know as a little gift that kind of is like towards her business um is get her some snacks to re-up for her other clients and i'll see what other like 
homie give I get to find. But we about to go ahead and head out, y'all, and I will check yeah. in with you guys at Target. All right, so I made it to Target, and I've been sitting here trying to find a gift card. So far, I actually like this one because it says something about home. It says home sweet home. And then I like this one. It says it's bottle popping time, and in the inside it just says congrats. So I'm actually going to take this one just because it says congrats, and, you know, I can write for both things, like finishing school and her new home. So I think I'm going to get her, like, these little small essentials like ice cube tongs measuring cups and i like these black ones because they look really sleek and her favorite colors are actually black and pink so i'm gonna take these and then i think i've seen her post stuff about her kitchen and the vibe look like it's black so these would be perfect all right y'all so I'm done. I got the gift bag and that for all the home stuff. I didn't end up having, yeah, adding it, a whisk yeah, yes, and some yeah, other it's, stuff. It's for Christmas. And then as far as snacks, I got these crackers, crackers. them gushers, these mm -hmm. na Nature Valley bars, chips, chips. waters. Because that's pretty much all she has had on there. I did want to get some other candies, but they didn't have the ones that I like. Well, they didn't have like a big bag with like different kinds of candy. So yeah, we about to go ahead and check out y'all. so i have made it to my nail appointment it doesn't start till 1 30 it's currently 1 13 but i stopped by to get us some food i got some japanese food that's why we're a little early because i wanted to sit in the car and eat real quick and i already um packed the gift up and you know the snacks back here i just need to go right in here and then we should go inside all right y'all we about to walk in You gotta say congrats. Oh, you coming out. <laughs> oh, this is congrats. sweet. And we got your snacks because you don't be oh, having snacks. That was sweet. That was sweet. Hold on, let me take this video. <laughs> okay, so we're doing duck nails for this set. These are little tips. I'm excited. But I told her I don't really want them like too ducky. And then we actually gonna be doing like an airbrush. Nah, they them were cute. And we also gonna be doing airbrush, so she ordered this little machine. And I'm excited. Let me show y'all the inspo that we're going with. I see you got it on your nails. The little kind of what we're doing. Yeah. Because I'll be sending her a lot. <laughs> so we're doing like the little 3D swirlies that's been trending. And then like the airbrush with it. So we're about to get started. Yeah. It's really coming to me that way. I mean, it's something that I stay with. The brother 
Cause they ain't really nothing to play with Steady chatting when I ran down She ain't say shit. My head is gon' bang quick Fuck around and get dangerous Step like bimbo Stop up to my tempo Toes no one ain't playing games on Xbox, Nintendo Real bitch, no force I stand on it, that's ten toes Pulled up with the big body With the dog tips on the window He says she sucks sweet They gon' wanna let her ride pop Let them taste the Then I keep them out right after Niggas vex cause I curve them when I want Get this wig, push that If the nigga try to fall uh, yeah. Don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it Come on baby, don't play with it Just lay it Spin or play it My hit is don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it They stay with it I'm okay with it When it come to me, they don't play with it Hey guys, so your girl's home and it's actually much later. I end up taking a nap after I got my nails done. As you guys see, the mascara is all like smirched or whatever. Check out the cute PJs. Mm -hmm. I got these cute little Hello Kitty PJs to match the vibes or whatever. Okay. I was actually supposed to get some Hello Kitty nails, but I was like, let me switch it up. But I'm about to do these little chicken soup dumplings from Trader Joe's. What? Y'all. 10 out of 10. But I actually had made some burritos last night, so we're gonna be eating that, but I'm just gonna eat this like a little oh, snack no. on the side as well. This is what they look like. And you just have to microwave them for two minutes, I believe. Yeah, two minutes. I like to cut a little hole at the top to steam it. So two minutes. And if you guys haven't been seeing these trend all over TikTok, then basically people eat it with this Trader Joe's chili onion crunchy um, sauce as well. And I've been seeing people add soy sauce, but I don't really like soy sauce like that. I do got some oil sauce that I like to add because this one is not really spicy. Alright, so it's done. I'm about to take it out this bag. First, I'm gonna add the crunchy onion stuff. So I put it on top of each. I like the crunchy stuff, so I like to add a lot of that. Then go in with the chili oil. So if you like soy sauce, you will add some right now. Okay, so I'm about to eat this. The dumplings first. And you just gotta. It's dark. Why is it like it? Because it's spicy. Okay. And then I got the burrito right here. And the only thing this one is missing is that little taco bell sauce we always get. Hey guys, so. I just got that eating, put my bonnet on, and I'm about to take this mascara off and whatnot, and then call it a night. So I just wanted to come and say goodnight to you guys really quick.
Good morning, guys. As you guys see, I'm starting my day off with these eye masks since I did my little skincare last night. We're in a car because we're actually about to head out. She's buying us some breakfast, so going to pick up from first watch, and then he actually has to run somewhere to pick up some materials he needs. So we're just in the car right now waiting on him, which he needs to hurry up because I'm hungry. Me too yep so that's what we're about to do right now and then the agenda for today i honestly think i want to actually work on my pink jenga that i left off in my last vlog because the paint for that actually came in as well so yeah that's what's on the agenda so i'm gonna check in with you guys once we um get our food or whatever all right y'all so we picked our food up we had to make an extra stop because they ain't put no utensils in there. Like, what? So, I got scrambled eggs on the side with some sausage. And then I got the banana almond crunch um, pancakes. 10 out of 10. And then I got the kids' pancake and sausage for Tizana. I'm pouring Tizana syrup. And then I got me a kale tonic as well. Y'all, the crunch and the like banana, like the whole combo is just perfect. Mm. You like your pancake? Mm -hmm. You like your pancake? Mm -hmm. And I was trying to be greedy and get two, like they're not big. Mm -hmm. Ma, you know I'm not a baby. You are a baby. Yeah. You my baby. I'm just not a baby. I'm just all your baby, but not, but. But I'm you're not a baby. What are you then? I'm a big girl. You're a big girl. Mm hmm That means I'm your baby, and then you're a big girl. Mm-hmm. All black right, y'all, so. I'm about, to, I'm about to put this up, and then I'm gonna check in with you guys. Hey guys, so I just got back home and our runs took way longer than expected. It's already um, 3 o'clock. But I have stopped at my mailbox and I got a gift that I want to open with you guys. It's from my girl that I always get my hoops from. I'll tag her on the screen. So thank you, boo. Hopefully she sent me some new hoops. It's a pink um, middle finger candle. So cute. And it smells so good. And then this is a booty candle. Look at this one. So cute. So she sent me over this hoodie as well. So it actually has like the hoop and then it says yep. the name on there. Yep. And on the back it just says her slogan which is Nacha Beauty Supply Hoops. Because you are the bomb.com. Yeah, what's inside? Okay, so I got new hoops. This is like a tilted square. There it go. It says baddest. And then I got this other one, same shape that say bad Tammy. I really love this spot. And then we actually did these before, but I think I put baddest, so I got some new ones. And she put bad Tammy on it. So cute. So make sure you guys shop with her. She also sent me this card and it says the baddest. You're doing amazing, sweetie. Ooh, I'm loving the pink vibes. Congrats on 100K. Oh, that is so cute. Congrats on 100K. You deserve it. It's been amazing watching you go from the ground up organically. Thank you for always supporting our brand. Such a genuine soul. Here's a small gift from us to you for your huge accomplishment. Cheers to many more. We've been letting everybody know to follow because if you're not watching Bad Tammy Dan, what are you doing? Hello, I love you. Your heir to faith fam. This is so freaking sweet. That food got me feeling a little tired. So I'm about to um, chill for a little bit. I probably just need a, you know, refreshing up so I can wake up and get my day started. Even though half the day is already gone. Hey guys, so it's much later. And I lied about the agenda today. Not intentionally. Tazana ended up taking a nap. And I don't really like waking her up when she's on her naps. And she actually hasn't been feeling all that well. And then I actually realized like I should do a little something for Cinco de Mayo. Since technically it's supposed to be like the Hispanic month or whatever. But technically we, we don't never really celebrate it. But just for the F of it. I do have these Bacardi um, margarita mixers that Mika got for me 
um, on Taco Tuesday. I've tried these with her in their bomb.com. So I'm just gonna make me one. Just a little margarita, margarita you know, to sip a little bit on for Cinco de Mayo. And then we're actually gonna go to our fave taco spot and just grab some tacos because it's only, you know, it's only right. It has four easy steps. You add Bacardi, you add um, ice cubes, and you know, just mix it up. But I have Tito's, so I'm gonna be using Tito's. So I'm about to go ahead and make this and then show you guys. I already have my blender out over here. So you just take this little thing off and then that's what it looks like. And then we just add it. Yeah, big, hey, barely get out. <laughs> All right, there we go. I'm supposed to put half of the drink in here, which that's all that's in there. Just enough to make this. So add that, and then it says just add ice. I'm not sure how much, so I'm gonna just add a few. So I'm gonna add some ice. That's how much. I'm gonna see if I need more or whatever once I blend. And now we blend. So I have my glass and I pour some lemon juice and sugar because I like sugar rams. So now we're gonna pour this in there like that. Then I'm gonna just add a lime at the top like that. So my drink is done and I'm about to try it. Perfect. The sugar rim is making it just be perfect for me. And it's like the perfect slushy. Mm. This is good. And I still have um, a good amount left maybe to make another round or two. So this one I'm about to sip on while we head out to go get our tacos or whatever. So we are back from picking our food up. And I'm on round number two. I only got like this much left. So pretty much when I'm done with this. I'm gonna eat. Yeah. All right, so this is the last little bit. Cheers. En tu perra vida, la palabra, déjate de payasadas, tú ya me perdiste, lo mejor es que te vayas. I'm about to eat and this is my food. I got two de asada and two de lengua. I love her tacos because she add these cucumbers. It goes perfect with the spice. Dang, I don't know the last time I had some lengua tacos. Listen, if I'm looking at shit because I took Tammy, my glam off. It's a, it's a girl steals something at the store. A place will get mm. them. Good night, y'all. Hey guys, so today it's Monday and your girl is basically about to start doing like little maintenance stuff for this Mother's Day month. Cause baby, the whole month is for us. We don't need just one day this, the whole month. Really every day. But Mother's Day is in a week. So I'm pretty much just gonna be getting glam for that for whatever the plans are. So today I have wax on the agenda i do have to hit the grocery store pick up on a few items and that's pretty much it oh i am getting eyebrows done as well so yeah guys pretty much these next few days i will be doing like you know little maintenance things here and there and then i also been working on the jenga project i did get to do a few already probably doodle on some more today and i'll show you guys that of course so with that being said guys i'm actually a few minutes from the location so i'll just see you guys then all right y'all so i just got my waxing done 
and it was eight out of ten. She said maybe because my cycle's on the way, it hurts a little more. But yeah, I'm glad that's out the way. But now we're moving on to brows, and I think I'm gonna get them tinted again. This is the before of the brows. Looking crazy. That's the same as the other one, like black and brown. Mm -hmm. Do you do um laminations too? Mm-hmm. How much you charge for that? Eighty five, but I don't want you to do that, dear. Why? <laughs> no. No. I've been liking like the little look. You can like use that. product. We have a product. I'll be using like eyebrow gel. Mm -hmm. So you I just recommend. another thing actually we have. <laughs> yeah, because I feel like sometimes with the it gives gel, you. it give it flaky, like white flaky. Right. Because your hair is so soft and I won't let you damn it <laughs> messed up your hair. It takes about six months to fix it. And so is it basically like um perming the hair? Perming, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. I look crazy. What if my brows was like this? You like my brows? Um, um. <laughs> yeah. Now I still did the threading on the mustache. So now we just gotta wait and let this sit for a few. Alright guys, so. I just left from getting my brows done and they look a little dark and crazy but last time actually when I came I felt like they looked too dark since it was my first time doing it and I went home and like wiped it off which I'm guessing that's why I left so this time I'm gonna actually let it sit and get dark like actually let it get on my light hairs so yeah this is what they look like right now I'm about to get some bubble tea because I've been craving it Mom, I want some bubble tea too Then we should hit the grocery store Mom, can I just ordered our stuff And now we just gotta wait But I've actually brought y'all here with me before I believe Susanna gets bubble tea with no bubble Like what? <laughs> and I'm getting the one with matcha So this one mine look like But of course I have to shake it I already shook Susanna's up But I told her she wanna get bubble Ready, set, go. <laughs> go get a napkin. Alright, so we're about to go, y'all. Hey guys, so I am back home already. I did stop at the grocery store, but I didn't bring you guys because it was packed in there. I like going to like neighborhood Walmart just because there's less people, but it was really crowded today and I don't really, you know, like all that action because sometimes, you know, I'll be having to like set up the camera and I don't want to be doing all that with too many people in the space so yeah and then it got hot outside and i'm over here sweating because i got long sleeves i actually wanted to show you guys the fit before i take it off you guys actually seen me wear this but i didn't really like show it show it to you guys so it's this long sleeve two piece from pretty little thing it's like an acid wash this is a like a bodysuit then i just paired it with these three since it has like a little gray vibe going on and yeah i really love this outfit i feel like it's definitely like aaron's outfit cute little two-piece and the body looks good in it i really like the fit to it but i'm about to take it off because your girl is actually sweating in it because earlier it was like a bit chilly but now it's like hot hot and then i think i'm gonna go ahead and get started on trying to do some of my little jingas which actually since we're talking about it and i have some of the ones that i already did in here i did end up doing two layers of the paint as you guys see it's much brighter and like more coverage it low-key matches my nail base but this is what this one says it says drink if you have on lashes then this one says you and the next player 
have to take a shot as you guys see i'm like doing the different colors from the sharpies that i showed y'all and then i did like a little cheers then this one says tallest person drink so i did like a, a tall person with like long legs this one says everyone drinks and as you guys see i did like beers um a bottle wine just different drinks and then this one says lowest percentage drink so basically like phone percentage and i did like a dead battery then this one says take a shot and i did like the o as like a little shot glass so i have some more over here that i already did but of course i'll make sure to you know show it to you guys once i'm done with all of them and like i said i'm gonna show you guys the new ones that i make so let me just change really quick
see if I can find like his little outfit at this store that my mom mentioned to me. So right now I'm on the way to get my toes done and then I will just check in with you guys. Alright guys, so I'm done with toes and I'm waiting on Chi to come pick me back up. But while I wait on him, I'm coming to this new deli and I'm gonna try it out. It's cute or whatever. Oh, it's real cute in here. And they got a big menu. So let's see. This is real cute though. Hopefully the food good. So I got picked up already and we bust this down. I'll give it an 8 out of 10 just because I wish it was toasted. But as you guys see, they had like a lot of bakery items and I grabbed a few to try. They had this strawberry muffin. Mm. That's real good. This is a honey almond crisp. I guess it's like a croissant. Mm, that's real good. I'm about to eat this right now. Then I got a pecan pie. I would try the pie right now, but they didn't put no um spoon. But I'm about to eat this. This is 10 out of 10. So I'm about to head home because I don't know if I mentioned, but I'm supposed to be meeting Weenie. We'll make sure I'm home by four because that's when she's supposed to um come drop Jazir off. So I'll probably check in with you guys around that time. All right, guys, so it's much later and I've actually been with Jazir for going on two hours now. He back here chilling. He was just throwing a fit though. But I'm finally meeting my mom at the um like bridal shop where they sell like the suits that I'm looking for for him. So we're gonna go ahead and go in here now. All right, y'all, these are the different suits. And as you guys see, they have like little different details. I like the one with the beard. Uh -huh, yeah. What is this? Recuerdo de mi bautizo. That one cute too. Jazir. I think these are the little ones she has. Is y'all trying it on now? Mm -hmm. Jazir. <laughs> He's too big. Yeah, it's too little. What size is that? Six months. I fit number two. He need 18. No more porque no quiere meter la mano porque aquí le entra bien aquí. Si este le queda bien a su medida. Stand up. A ver, párenlo. Bro, that looks so funny. Move on me. Va a soltar el botonazo. Ya que lo agregaste. Ya es el mal. ¿Qué? Este es mi bautizo. 
Oh, Hello, I need a size up, Tammy. Sí. Saca el pantalón, el chorro. That's what you're going with. Yeah, no like so 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 <laughs> <laughs> it looks like he's going to pop up. Oh, 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 oh. All right, guys, we're already home. Now, as y'all see, Jazz is content now because he watching his show. He really like Mickey Mouse. So he's trying to watch TV and Tazana just in his face. So they just going to be sitting here chilling. Hey y'all, so Batman already got picked up and it's much later. Um, I'm actually about to make a quick dinner for us. Quick and easy dinner. I had some chicken breasts um that i had on thought honestly wanted to make a salad but i think i'm just gonna make this pasta that actually um my sister has made before and i really liked it so i have my chicken breast i have the rigatoni noodles so i believe it's called like a spicy rigatoni pasta i don't really know if i'm saying it right so i have tomato paste and then a little bit of parmesan cheese and then i just need my heavy whipping cream that's in the fridge and then of course i'm gonna just season the chicken up but the only difference is i totally forgot that it is like a breaded bread so i didn't get any bread crumbs so i'm just gonna you know have regular chicken breast but i am gonna cook it on the little ninja wood fire that we just got so i feel like that's gonna give it a good you know taste and make sure it's still juicy so i'm gonna go ahead and season my chicken and do that and you know get the noodles boiling and like i said it should be done in no time
food is about to be done. Alright guys, dinner is ready. Sorry if the lighting is just so crazy in here. But I'm ready to try this. I did add more um red pepper flakes and stuff to mine just because I didn't want to make it real spicy for them. Yeah, I need some more red pepper flakes. Yeah, true true. It's not as spicy as I wanted it, but like I said, I didn't want to make it too spicy in the pot because I remember when my sister made it, I remember it being spicy. That's why I liked it. So I'm about to sit here and enjoy my dinner, guys. And this is pretty much the end of my night. Um, I did make a strawberry milk, as you guys seen. I don't think we're gonna try it until tomorrow. Or at least I'm gonna let it like chill because I heard it's better when it's chilled. With more um red pepper flakes is definitely adding the spice that I like. But anyways, good night y'all. Hey guys, so today it is Thursday and I just have errands to run really. I know I mentioned that pretty much now we're just doing like preparing and enjoying mother's day weekend i has i still haven't made it to sephora so that's what i'm planning to do today and then i also have to run to marshall's and then i have to pick up my sister from the airport today so that's on the agenda because tomorrow actually my sister is planning is planning a like mother's day spa for all the mamianas y'all know um nana always goes out her way to you know show us love every year so i'm really excited for that so we're really doing you know trying to grab as many things that we can because she's been out of town so she's just not coming back yeah. that's really all that i have on my agenda today let's sure. show outfit of the day before we head out Ma, show my outfit this is tazana's outfit so cute and my girl has been rocking her tail feezy what's in your bag Money. Period. <laughs> and then this is my little cute outfit. I just have on this white skirt, pretty little thing, and this custom sprayed um tank top that says Tammy. We got all the little pink details. And y'all, this skirt is hugging the body. Even though it is white, it's like a little see-through. But I think we should be good. And I'm just wearing it with my hyper pink um ones. As you guys see, it's like the white pink vibes. I haven't wore these shoes in like forever. And I'll be having a lot of my shoes just sitting. So yeah, I'm just pulling these out because they're so cute. And I'm just going to wear my pink MCM bag that I've been wearing. And we're about to go ahead and head out, guys. So yeah, let's go. I'm 
quick to switch up my plans My mind, I'll pack my bag and I'm say shit I got what it takes to say this I got all the plays and I played it out like Okay, y'all, so we have picked Nana up from the airport and we made it to Marshall's, making our little store run. Yep. That rose gold still kind of gives me like a little whitish with a pink. They got this blemish remover. I need some more of these, but when I be styling my hair. Yeah, look at this cute little vase. We're gonna take this one. All right, yeah, we're gonna take this little diffuser, oil diffuser, and this is our cart. We're about to go ahead and check out. All right, yeah, we made it to Home Goods, and this is what's in the buggy so far. We're trying to find the spa things. Oh. Things. But you, they got like by color, so we going with the neutral vibe. I love lavender though. Well, this look like the only brownish. What is this? Bath soak. Bath soak. But you already have the Epsom salts. All right, y'all leaving from Home Goods, and we ain't really find much. We about to try to make it to down. We not gonna make it to Winston Marshalls. Is that close? Yeah. It just looked like that. So we're gonna see if we make it. Hey guys, so we are at Target now. Still trying to pick up on some few things that we see that we need. Yeah. Cause that's more sweet, so some mom Yeah. So we trying to get some champagne. We getting the real stuff here. That's for you and Claudia. Yeah. <laughs> Cause everybody usually always complains about if something is too bitter or too strong they like the weak stuff this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah that so that's for the other moms how many things i should do two or three two you know once i get the drinking yeah more. that one's saying i was gonna say three but three. see me baby i'm gonna have a good time i've been mommying so i'm trying to relax and have right. a good time so y'all know spas we usually have that cucumber water so that's what we got that for just picked up on some other mask a body scrub and then i'm throwing some little pimple patches in there for me we're gonna add these champagne glasses they matching the vibe and we also got these for the cucumber water hey guys so i am finally home from running all these errands y'all my feet are literally on 10 like on 10 no exaggeration and on top of that i just came home and just cleaned up a little bit around here just because i am going to be gone tomorrow and you know once we get back from that relaxing day i wanted to just be clean around here so really these plans for nana are last minute just because the original plans that she had didn't go through so i basically have to be you know i'm like the party planner or whatever i have to basically put it together so i will most likely be up early tomorrow you know to head over there and have everything set up so i'm gonna go ahead and call it a night actually let me show you guys the stuff that i did pick up from sephora i got to get this like gucci floral perfume like a gift set i actually have this one and i like it and then i also got this one the blue con i never seen this one but i just thought it was so cute so i grabbed it since we're doing like you know spa facials i got us this fenty skin it's a cookies and cream detox face mask i bought a dior lip maximizer one is actually mine and then the other one is a gift and then i bought these little hand sanitizers because i thought they were so cute i always see them when i'm going there so I finally just grabbed one. I just want to have this in my bag. And then I got one to put into Zana's bag. Okay, I didn't really get to find much in there. I thought I was going to find like more mommy kind of girly fragrances. But I didn't. But that's it for tonight guys.
because like I said, I'm tired. Good night, guys. Hey, y'all, so it's the next day and I'm finally at Nana's because we still had to run errands today. But we're finally about to set up. She did want me to do a little bit of balloons. So that's what I'm gonna do first because I feel like that's usually what takes long. So the vibes is like white and neutral. So as you guys see, I just got white balloons, brown, and nude. So that's what I'm about to go ahead and do now. Hey guys, so it is much later. I didn't really get to show you guys stuff because I literally just been on crunch time, running really, 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 really behind. And right now I just came home to get like a little semi dress. Even though it is like spa, I'm just doing like my under eyes just to get a little cute, you know, picture or whatever. I didn't take my robe and stuff that I needed to take since it is like spa, so I came to pick that up. And then just some little last minute things. But I'm about to, you know, go ahead and head out. Yeah, I literally just been on crunch time trying to get everything put together. Really what happened was we still had to run a little bit of errands this morning. So that's kind of what put it, pushed us behind. And y'all know we always good for running late anyways. But everybody else knows how to be on time. So the girls were on time. While we were still setting up, they were pulling up so it really just made everything harder and i was just trying to get everything done like i said so i didn't get a chance to show you guys much but i did want to update you guys or whatever like i mentioned the vibe is like neutral so i just have on this light brown skims on it's not the matching set but it's light brown so it's whatever i just have to run probably two more errands before i head back to nana's house and then i should get started on you know finally getting to relax because i haven't been relaxing i one bit today i'm really like irritated low-key but when i get over there i pretty much you know show you guys how it looks how everything came together um so pretty and perfect like always and you know just get started on relaxing like i said so i'll just check in with you guys <laughs> Honestly, I'm trying to stay focused You must think I've got to be joking when I say I don't think I can wait I just need it now Let it swing my way I just need some deep I just need some love 
Even though this one broke, but she didn't bring her acrylic stuff. I think I'm gonna just do a little color change on the toes. Cheers. My mommy got me a gift, so I'm gonna open it. All right, so I got a little pedicure, but not really. She just fixing my nails. Cause y'all know they mess me up at the shop real bad. <laughs> and she gonna put these little charms on me. This is already given. I wasn't aware of this. <laughs> this is so cute. Alright, y'all, these are my toes. They're cute. Yeah, they looking way better. This is a shake for me. Happy Mother's Day I'm to the best mothers out here. Happy Mother's Day. Spa done turned into a damn dance party. Calm little dance, calm little turn up. Hey, 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 hey,
Uganda, a damn diffuser. Hey, 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 hey. Hey guys, so as y'all see, we are back at home. We are about to wrap this night off. So yeah, I'm tired. I just want to relax. Y'all know I had a little busy day or whatnot. You girl is about to KO tonight was a pretty good day um it was pretty chill and you know just relaxing mm. for the mommy annas i really appreciate my sister well nana and karen you know just catering to us today even though it's not um mother's day today but you know it was like a little mini celebration for us i still want to say you know happy mother's day to all my mommy annas that watch me or whatever so yeah guys i'm pretty much just about to ko like i said your girl is pretty tired but before i log out for the night i did want to show you guys the little gift that nana got us she got me these little pink roses and then she also gave me this mommy coupon so basically it says this coupon is to be presented to nana for anything you desire i know as a mother you have 100 things to accomplish for example could be used for help on a bill or even better something for you that you want can't wait to see what i can help you with happy mother's day i want to i want to use it for something good so i'm gonna sit on this probably and just you know think and see what i can cash this in with so yeah good night guys good morning guys so today is officially mother's day it's 10 52 so I'm like 11 o'clock in the morning as you guys see i am doing my hair i'm gonna show you guys the braid down under this because baby it was a struggle with the nails and i really didn't want to take them off but then I was like, if I want my hair to look really good, I'm about to take them off. But whatever. So I'm doing that. So basically, I'm doing like a quick weave on myself. The only difference is that I'm trying it with a 2x6 closure instead of doing a leave out. Because I don't want to keep burning out my front hair. So this is what it looks like. I got it from Amazon. I'll have a link for you guys. I already sprayed some got to be and now I'm going in with this protective shield stuff. Don't pick up the pieces, just leave it for now. 
The only thing is I think I put too much like glue so it was like all the way over here but I just wiped it off with alcohol and it looks much better and I feel like I can blend the closure maybe a little better with um the makeup but I might not put too much makeup on there so as you guys see basically the face is prepped to do my little glam let me put you guys down here so basically I don't really have plans for today I didn't get to get all my mother shopping so i'm probably just gonna tell them you know to send me something that they want and then i'll just buy it well i have i have been um told my sister claudia that so i'll most likely tell shayla and then for my mom um i feel like i always usually get her the same things and i actually found this cute little thing at marshall's that said something about like best grandma it was like in a pink heart from like basically from Tizana. So I think I'm just going to put some money in there for her. And, and yeah, that's pretty much it. But we don't really have any spectacular plans for today. Um, my mom did tell us to go over because I guess her and Pedro were doing a little something. Like a little cookout or whatnot. Because really I didn't feel the vibe of like just having like decor balloons like roses i feel like it's the same thing really like gifting wise like moms like that's all you're gonna see is roses balloons and little stuff like that like i didn't want that i just didn't want that to be honest i just told she like just don't even do it because i really don't i really do not i really don't care for it i told him i really just want to go to the beach and he just painted his truck that he got so he wanted to ride somewhere so we're gonna go like on a little mini beach road trip again sort of like we did last year now that i'm thinking about it we were supposed to be leaving today but then i was just like i don't really want to be on the road like all mother's day i'd rather you know like spend it at home with my family or you know doing a, at least you know a little something small intimate than just being on the road and i was like it's most likely going to be traffic if we try to you know sit down and eat everything is mostly going to be like packed out for like reservations so i was just like let's just not eat so yeah guys that is the plan so i'm really just talking your head off i'm probably come back and talk to you guys when i'm already dressed Mom, you want some packages? okay so happy mother's day to all my mommy annas keep being a wonderful mom and i would just come talk to you guys in a minute because i think there's a fly in here like y'all know it's that season with the bugs and stuff all right guys so i end up putting on this skimp rumper on i thought i had the dress i probably do but i found this one first so i just put this one on um but mika came earlier and she dropped off my gift and then i gave her hers she got us Tell, let me see. so it's a three in one facial cleansing spa and allergy treatment so it's like a steamer basically okay Oh, and it comes with a whole, it's an 11, 
11 piece set it comes with a black hair removal kit and a facial brush and hairband as well mine is okay. leaving okay and then she got me feels like it's like some accessories okay so it's a bracelet and it has like a camera on there so it's a bracelet with like a little camera on it <laughs> so cute I've been needing some bracelets too because my other gold ones that I used to have um, broke. Uh, so this is another one with my initial a T and like bedazzle. This is so cute. I'm actually going to put these on right now. And it fits perfect on the wrist. So guys, I'm actually going to go ahead and head out to my mom's. And then I will just check in with you guys over there. But this is how it looks. So cute. All right, y'all. So actually, I stopped by to get these roses for my mom because I know she loves the red ones. So I made it to my mom's. I just got this quick idea since I'm giving her money. Um, and the little thing that I told you guys I found. I found this cute way to make them into hearts. And I just thought to show you guys. So you fold it in half and then you bring both of the sides in like so. Then you flip it over and do little triangles at the top. You're meeting everything in the middle. And then you fold the top part so it should look like this and then you fold this top part down. It's not the best because of my nails but yeah. Then this part, you bring it up and you kind of got to like fold it right here. And then you fold this center, this top and the middle like this. So you fold in that and like that. Everything that you do on one side, you do it on the other. And then this is the final product, a little heart. So Tazana wanted to give her some money from her piggy bank. So she gave her $2 and then I made her some with these so this is what it looked like and then this is the little thing we found it says best best abuela ever inside it says thank you for being the best abuela in the world so cute and it goes perfect because it's like four for like the four daughters that she has and then this is a better look of the roses that I got her it looks like it's an actual like mini mini party I thought it was just something a little more like intimate but y'all you know how she is extra that's where we get it from and my camera is my camera is actually dying so i'll probably vlog off my phone all right y'all serve myself this is my plate y'all know the usual she actually got hella more stuff over there but i'm about to eat this for now this is the food y'all i think this is chicken pasta shrimp pasta this the chicken salad she got the red and green salsa she got some ceviche hey guys so it's much later and i just been to my mom and shayla came to drop this off for me let me show y'all so cute so it's strawberries pink and this cup that says mama i really just love the details this is so cute so yeah i'm about to well y'all know tazana gonna f these up but i just thought that was so cute and we still just been out here chilling i'm about to start Sipping some penny that Jonah got. But we just been chilling pretty much. Cheers. Mother's Day. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers to the best mom. Bye -bye. Period. Period. Bye -bye. Hey guys, so I just wanted to come back on here and say that this is the end of my video. Last night was pretty much just intimate, just you know, like a homey, very simple Mother's Day we had, and I really enjoyed it. But I don't think I really showed you guys much this is the end so i will see you guys in my next video bye